everyone, I found the number two in Texas. Barney? Kids? Baby Bob? Well, they must be down in the playground. There. And I must keep looking for more numbers. Stella! Stella! Uh, oh, I thought I heard Stella. Mm, well, I'm gonna go make some more numbers. Say, Barney, Ooh. kids! Come on down here. Here's another book Stella was looking through last week. <laughs> what did he what? say? <laughs> Thanks, Barney. You're welcome. I guess I shouldn't talk with my mouth full. <laughs> I was saying it's a good story called Belling the Cat. Oh, then let's read it. <laughs> Okay. Once upon a time, in the wall of a farmer's cottage, there lived four playful mice named Chancy, Dancy, Fancy, and Clancy. They loved to play all day. Of course, Dancy loved to dance. While Chancy, Fancy, and Clancy like to play tag. You're it, Clancy. I'm going to tag you, Fancy. You have to catch me first. Oh, how those mice love to play. Eat the rock scissors. One day, the mice were surprised to see that the farmer had bought a cat to live in his cottage. Oh, dear Chancy, look outside. The farmer's bought a cat. I hope he can't see us. Some cats like to chase mice. I'm afraid he might catch us. If we put a bell on the cat's collar, we can hear him coming and hide before he gets to the clothes. Great idea, Fancy. I'm the bravest mouse of us all. If anyone can build a cat, I can. Well, do be careful, Clancy. Never fear, Chancy. So, Clancy tiptoed up to the cat as he napped in the afternoon sun. But when he got close enough to the cat, he became frightened and ran back to the others. <laughs> What's wrong, Clancy? Did you get scared? No. I just didn't think it was the right time. Oh, I'll do it. Ha! You're too small, Fancy. You're not big and strong like me. If I can't build a cat, no mouse can. I'm braver than you think, Clancy. In fact, I'll build a cat while he's awake. I'll walk up to him and say, 